You're probably wrong about Ed Gein. He was never considered a serial killer. Gein lived a solitary life in Plainfield, Wisconsin. After his mother died, he became extremely interested in grave robbing, death, and World War II atrocities. His dark secret came to light with the disappearance of Bernice Warden in 1957, leading the police to his home where they uncovered a horrifying collection of human remains. Even though people often consider him a serial killer, Gein has been determined to have killed just two people. Mary Hogan in 1954, and Bernice Warden in 1957. But the reason he became so infamous is because of what he would do to the dead. He would use corpses to make various objects like clothes, masks, and furniture made of human skin. He even had a collection of noses and a shoebox containing preserved female genitalia. Unsurprisingly, Gein was determined to have mental health conditions and spent the rest of his life confined in psychiatric institutions. His story inspired the creation of horror icons like Norman Bates, Leatherface, and Buffalo Bill. Gein died in 80 and his grave is now unmarked after numerous instances of vandalization.